Hi everyone, in this problem we have to find the domain of this function. So this is a function of three variables. So the inputs are ordered triples. The inputs are actually points in space. And so as we do this, uh, we just have to look at each piece and just find out what are the possible restrictions on x, y, and z. So let's focus first on the y. So here you have e to the 1 over y. So the only time this is going to be an issue is if y is equal to 0, because then you would get uh, 1 over 0. So y cannot be equal to 0. What about this piece here? Well, the natural log can only take positive values as inputs. So z has to be positive. Right? You can't have the natural log of 0, and you can't have the natural log of a negative number. You can only plug in positive numbers into logs. So z must be positive. And on the bottom, the only restriction here would be that we can't divide by 0 because we're not allowed to have 0 on the bottom of a fraction. So x cannot be equal to 0. So those are our three restrictions. So now the next step is to write the answer correctly. So it's really important to use the correct notation in these problems. So it's a set, so we tend to use like these curly braces. And the inputs to this function are points in space. They're ordered triples. So we do have to write parentheses x, y, z, and then such that, so it's a set of all ordered triples in space, such that the following conditions are satisfied. So whatever we write here, those are the conditions. And we already figured them out. I'm going to write the x1 first. So x not equal to 0, y not equal to 0, and we also have to have z be positive. Whenever you put a comma like this, there's an implied and, okay? So it's, you could put the word and if you like. I just didn't want to have to write it twice. I felt a comma is much easier than writing and. So, but it's read as x is not equal to 0 and y is not equal to 0 and z is positive. That's how you read the statement. So it's the set of all ordered triples in space such that these conditions are true. I hope this video has been helpful.